what is up welcome back here to us if you're new here i am ashley alor this is my channel we're going to get right into this anything you need to know about me my readings buying your personal reading okay anything like that jewelry all that stuff smudges sages personal baths all that stuff spiritual baths is all down below pattern tiktok instagram all that stuff donations is all down below all right so i'm going to go ahead and get right into this reading here we're going to jump right into this pisces not pisces excuse me taurus i don't know why i said pisces anyways Taurus, the Taurus, you're Captain Taurus, okay? So Taurus, let's get into it. Not Taurus, okay, but Taurus. All right, this will be a nine card spread. This is a general reading, okay? Take for resonate, skip what doesn't, okay, guys? And let's see what's going on with you guys, the Tauruses, okay? Yes, yes, yes. Let's see what's going on with you guys. I don't have any music playing because I was watching TV, but let's see what music my um phone plays for the Tauruses. Let's see. I'm hearing that song, I'd rather be with you, ooh, yeah. Anyways, let's see what it says. So I have Beat It. <laughs> Beat It playing by Michael Jackson, okay? I don't know his sign or whatever, but anyways, um, let's go ahead and see what's going on with you guys, Taurus, okay? Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's get these cards for Taurus. So the first card we have is Magician card here, okay? All right. Let's see what else we have for you guys. So I have the Five of Cups here, okay? I have the Empress card, okay? Let's see what else we have for you guys, Taurus. Hmm. All right, so we have the Eight of Swords reversed. We have the Hangman, okay? And we have the Four of Wands here. Let's see what else we have for the third final row. Okay, interesting. So, there's a lot of cards. Too many cards, Spirit. Too many cards. I didn't see the two of cups, though. Let's see what else we have going on. All right. Torrance, Torrance, the little stubborn butts. Okay, so I have three cards. The Ace of Swords, the Knight of Swords, the Nine of Pentacles, and the Wheel of Fortune. So, I'll, I'll keep those four cards. At the bottom, we have the Ace of Cups here. You could definitely point back into yourself or your own cup or like I said, working on your security at this time here. Working on, how do you say, your blessings and what you have going on here, Torrance, okay? Okay. So, first things first, with this Magician card here, I'm seeing there's some type of surprise. It's a good surprise coming up for you, but I'm getting, um, you're definitely losing money at this time here. And it's funny, it's 111 on a timestamp. That is so funny. Anyways, so that's what's going on for you guys. All right, um, we have the Five of Cups or something. You're crying over spilled milk or you're crying over this Empress. Whoever this Empress is or whoever whoever this is, or you could actually be the Empress here. Take it how it resonates, flip it how you need to. All right, but um, I'm getting all is not lost. You need to know this. Like I said, um... Um, you may have, you may be trying to pick up the pieces where you left off, or you're like, like you're crying over spilled milk, trying to pick up these cups, not seeing these other two cups you have behind you, not seeing the, how do you say, um, what you have left here, what you have to salvage here. I'm getting like, there's definitely a good surprise. You could definitely went through a breakup or this empress or whatever you're crying over here. I'm getting like you try to. So with the magician card here and the eight of swords, I'm getting like you finally made up your mind and know that you have everything that you need to um, accomplish, which you need to accomplish here, but you're in your own way. Okay, we have the hangman here and the five of cups, like I said. So like I said, whatever um, you have going on here, it's because you need to get stronger with yourself here. That's why the song Beat It is playing here. All right, you know what you have to do. It's time for you to either get it together or beat it, okay? All right. Yeah, this ain't a show the day. You know what you got to do with the Five of Cups energy here. And we also have the Hangman. So like I said, whatever um, hole you try to trap somebody up in or vice versa, they end up getting themselves caught in there. Or there is you. I'm seeing you in a lot of deep shit right now. On some deep doo-doo. I'm seeing you to get stronger with yourself, your personal real, your personal power here, okay? I'm seeing like you put so much into other people or you're always worrying about the wrong thing here, okay? Yeah, whoever this empress is, they have the four wands. So they have happy home life, happy life, happy wife energy. They could actually be your wife. It doesn't have to be with somebody who you see as marriage material. It doesn't have to be with the four wands here, okay? Men or female here. Um, Taurus, okay? Um, or this could be your husband, whoever this person is, okay? Whoever this person is, I'm definitely getting they have their own home. But like I said, over the stress, there's something about their home or something about them being happy, their stability, they're set, they're stable, okay? Or I'm hearing they're putting in the work. Four and three is seven. This, is, this person is divinely guided to either be in your life or divinely guided to leave you, okay? Anyways, we have the Ace of Swords here overall. So I'm seeing like you have to cut out the bullshit. I'm hearing like you cut out whatever that was frustrating you. Great job here. You need to be doing that at this time here with the Knight of Swords. You def definitely have some type of situation that has unfinished minutes here or um, is being wrapped up pretty quickly. As soon as you either get your shit together with the Nine of Pentacles here. Because I see you're discontent for whatever this is. You don't have peace of mind. So I'm seeing 
You need to say you lose your mind to find peace of mind. You can be losing your mind or lose everything to find peace of mind to get everything together. Because at this time, with the Wheel of Fortune reversed here, okay, you're definitely blocking your blessings here. Okay, Taurus or Taurus, okay. All right, let's go ahead and clarify this Magician card with the Eight of Swords here and see what that is about, okay, for you guys. Okay. Magician card and the Eight of Swords reversed here for the, um, for the, um, Taurus. Yeah, we have the Ten of Cups reversed here, so it doesn't matter who's wrong or right. I'm getting like you, you decide you had your Ten of Cups eight, one, it's like eight, nine, ten. That's where it is, eight, nine, ten. You ended the cycle. I'm getting like whatever you made happy, Ten of Cups reversed here, you no longer have it because you're stuck in your head here. You feel like you're stuck in a cycle, you're stuck somewhere here with nowhere to turn to. All right, yeah, we have the Death card reversed here. You did not win the war here, you definitely won the battle with whatever you had going there, whatever you were had going going here but you did not win the war here men or female okay i'm seeing you have a new beginning here okay but you're moving your feet and you're about to lose your seat on this new beginning or the ride of this new beginning here okay yeah you see how this how, you see how death is on a horse here you're gonna miss your horse carriage okay cinderella energy that could be the empress here cinderella we have virgo at the bottom of the deck here you could definitely do some soul searching like i said or you could have virgo placements okay but i'm seeing um you may be feeling very lonely at this time here i'm seeing you do a lot of inner work okay we have the Empress card and we have four of wands. What, what a song is this? It's called Decline by Lil T J. You could be declining people or being declined here. All right, we have the Empress card here. Let's see what that's about here. I just see the Ace of Wands at the bottom of the deck here. There will be a new beginning or there can be possibly. All right. But I'm also getting with the King of Swords energy. I'm getting like um, somebody's being very cold, abrasive, or demanding respect. This could definitely be you. Whoever this is who's demanding respect here, they by doing this or doing something too quick or overdoing somebody's power or something like that here. Yeah, they blocked your blessing here with the Ace of Pentacles. Or like I said, your wish is going to be granted. But after you stand up for yourself here, after you demand respect and ask you how do you say be a man or be a woman about it, okay? All right, let's get one last card here, Spirit. Let's see. Yeah, I have the Seven of Cups energy. You have options. Or like I said, somebody has options here. I'm um, here like choose wisely. All the good is not gold here. Look beyond the cloud. Look beyond the bullshit. Look beyond what's ailing you, okay? And and, and really see the bigger picture, okay? Let's see what's going on with this Ace of, Ace of Swords here. And the Eight of Swords in the reverse. Let's see what's going on with that here. I'm saying you need to cross your teeth and dot your eyes this time here. Make your next move your best move and put to rest what you know you need to put to rest. This could be old beliefs, old people, people using you, okay? How do you say things that need to be um, pulled together? You need to take a time out. Rest but never quit here. Okay, I'm seeing like you maybe want to travel. You may be traveling soon. All in all, your ships are about to come in, but only if you do the work here. Yeah, you need to make your next move your best move with the Three of Wands energy here. Let's see what's going on with this Hangman, this Knight of Swords here with this Nine of Pentacles. Your discontentment or miserableness, okay? Or somebody else is here. This is, I get like either this is you or this is what's going on around you. Yeah, with the Page of Wands in reverse, I'm getting like you're not traveling. I'm here like you're, you're, you're falling back from something or you're having to restart something, all right? Somebody that distance from somebody watching somebody make their next move, their best move here. Yeah, we have the moon card of birth. The, um, there's some type of secret came out or somebody found out somebody was being emotionally deceptive here. This could have been you or somebody doing this to you or whatever. Yeah, we have the eight of pentacles. I'm saying you need to keep your head down and keep working here. That's what somebody is doing here, okay? We have the four of wands energy. We also have the wheel of fortune reversed here. Let's see what's going on here for you, um, Taurus. All right, so I'm seeing the seven of swords here. I'm getting like there's a lot of treachery, a lot of sneaky shit going on. I'm getting like whatever plans and hopes you have going on here, they will not prosper until you put in the work here, okay? You could want to go to Miami or been to Miami or Florida this year or whatever. All right, all in all, we have the ten of pentacles in reverse here. So I'm getting like you're having money issues. Or like I said, um, whatever agreement that you agreed to, you made a bad deal with the strength card coming with the Leo or somebody. Have some type of confrontation or some type of um shit that's going on around you, okay? Negative energy or like conflict or bullshit, whatever this is. But I'm seeing you to be strong within yourself and your willpower here to conquer this shit. Yeah. Yeah, I'm hearing like you need to grind so hard that you forget to eat. No shade, but with the King of Wands here and also the King of Cups here, that's the energy. So there's two kings in the castle cannot be. So King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy doesn't have to be. King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. All in all, Six of Pentacles. In reverse, somebody couldn't see eye to eye. Or some, I'm getting like somebody can reciprocate with this King of Cups here because they were too busy trying to be outspoken and, how do you say, restless and ambitious. Or like I said, somebody was just... Doing what the fuck they want to do with the two of pentacles. They chose wrong or you chose wrong. We have ace of cups here. So I'm seeing somebody just, how do you say, watching somebody um fulfill their cup or fulfill their destiny here. All right. 
I'm very interested in reading here with the Nine of Cups and the Ten of Swords. I'm getting somebody has having a lovely day and somebody's not having a lovely day, okay? Ten of Swords is virtuous. Somebody's definitely, how do you say, there's an ending or something or something doesn't want to end, okay? But why somebody else is content about that, okay? Or content about their accomplishments or whatever. They're very, feeling very smug or pleased here with what they have going on. All in all, yeah, with the high, high pieces card here, some type of secrets here, some type of good secrets about to be revealed here or something. Truth of the matter has been, how do you say, exposed here. Now the Five Pentacles, somebody trying to come out the cold here. I'm somebody trying to act like they're not, but they are. With the Ten of Wands energy and the Page of Pentacles, I'm seeing like there's a lot of burdens here. All right, this could be you or some a younger energy here. Oh no, I'm seeing like the student needs somebody needs to do more studious shit. I'm getting like somebody sent communication here, but it wasn't reciprocated here because somebody is a fool. Somebody has took a leap of faith here. Or somebody who's standing stagnant. Let me see. What cards needs to fail on the floor? We have the lovers card of verse. We have the three cups of verse. We have six of swords. So somebody had third party here. Somebody had a love affair. Somebody had another love. Er, okay, this could be you or somebody else. And I have two swords that moved on. Somebody moved on here. Okay, or somebody had um, how do you say what love got to do with it? Tina Turner energy. Okay, oh no, somebody's keeping things to themselves here. Six of cups. Okay, and the judgment card. All right, so that's what's going on here. Ooh. All right, that was very interesting here. All right, what song is this? Swear, okay, by Johnny Cinco. Go listen to that. S-W-E-A-R, Swear by Johnny Cinco. All right, once again, it's in the general reading. All right, but let's go ahead and see what else we have. We got this time here. All right, let's see what cards we have. So I'm seeing to take a self-care day and um, worry about yourself here. Worry about um, how, you, how you say making yourself feel good. Worry about your emotions. You know, just take it one day at a time here, Taurus. Let's see what else we have for you guys. Let's see what how, what's going on here for the Taurus. Okay, let's see what's going on here. So it says, yeah, you have some new cycles coming to you guys ahead in the future here. Let's see what else we have going on. What other cards come out? All right, let's see what else is going on here. What two cards these? You will be receiving a large cash deposit soon, but you need to do yoga at this time here. But you need to uh, hike it, walk around, get in nature, get out, move your body a little bit more, okay? Let's see what else we have for you guys, Taurus. I'm saying you need to appreciate yourself more. And it says you, your new business will make millions here. You may be thinking about starting a business here. But all in all, there's a storm ahead and your root chakra is blocked here, okay? Yeah, there could actually be storms in your area ahead. Like I said, there's trouble ahead at this time here. But all in all, you're about to meet your soulmate here. This could, person could have been your soulmate. All right, but all in all, your root chakra is blocked here. So you may have lower leg swelling or pain at this time here. Or somebody around you does. All right, let's see what else we have. Let's get one last card here. The front, it says a new love is coming in. And at the back, it says meditate on your alignment. You're out of alignment, okay? You're not where you're supposed to be or your energy is off, okay? Yep, that's what's going on here. Taurus, I'll see you guys in the next one.